Hi, this is Christy Benedictus with your latest in the world of movies. I recently saw The Maze Runner, and while I had a reasonably enjoyable time watching it, I would say it's not for everyone. Some parts were very annoying, but others were quite fun. It's nowhere near as good as the Hunger Games series, which it clearly wishes to imitate, but it definitely has potential. I say see it if you like other young adult dystopian films, like The Hunger Games or Divergent, but otherwise, skip it. This is the only film I've seen recently, so I thought I would talk about what to look forward to in the month of October. Gone Girl premieres this Friday, October 3rd, and this film has me very excited. You've got David Fincher directing. You've got Gillian Flynn, the author of the novel the film is based on, writing the script. You've got the stud, Ben Affleck, and you've got Rosamund Pike in her first major, major starring role. This film is basically tailor-made for my enjoyment. Look for my thoughts on it early next week. On October 10th, Whiplash will see a limited release, but you should definitely seek it out. Winner of the U.S. Grand Jury Prize at this year's Sundance Film Festival, the film is about a young drummer, played by Miles Teller, and his brutal teacher, played by J.K. Simmons. The movie looks to be a psychological thrill ride through the rigors of musical perfection, and I can't wait for it. Lastly, at the very end of the month, on Halloween, Nightcrawler hits theaters. Jake Gyllenhaal stars as a seedy underground reporter who starts tampering with crime scenes to get the next big story. I love me some Jake, so I can't wait to see this one. Also during the month of October, I will be journeying into the depths of terror. I almost never watch horror films, so for your viewing pleasure, I will be subjecting myself to a plethora of scary movies suggested to me by the staff here at ACMI. I am already dreading this decision. That's all for me. I'm Christy Benedictus. See you next time.